try and get under here, show you a little bit of the undercarriage. My light. Alright, so I did the custom exhaust about, I guess, the same year that I got it, so it's all sound. It's got a nice sound to it, but I know that doesn't matter. You're going to swap the motor out. Uh, I'll try and get some light up here. I haven't done anything with the, uh, really with the drivetrain at all. Um, so, what I'm trying to show you here is it's dry. Don't even leaks. I have no idea what's going on in there, but I don't really have any reason to be concerned. I haven't, uh, haven't any spots on the driveway since I've owned it. And, uh, I haven't done anything with the brakes. I haven't done anything with the shocks. It's a little squishy, but I imagine if you're gonna do what you said you're gonna do with it, you're probably gonna beef up the suspension a little bit anyway. Um, I don't know if you can see too well up there, but somebody uh, coated the undercarriage with some. You know, it's uh, I forget what you call that. I don't know if it's Z bar or what, but they uh. He treated the undercarriage. I'll get a better shot of it here. I'll move to the front. Uh, um, I think he wanted to see the U joints. changed the oil not too long ago just check the fitting for that but I haven't had any spots on the driveway so but maybe you can see the oil is clean and uh oh that's a uh, bigger oil pan I don't know why I did that I just did it oh you don't care about that anyway you're gonna swap the engine out you not gonna have any problems getting six or eight months out of it, whatever you wanted. Um, yeah, I don't know anything about all this stuff, so I'll just take some pictures. Let you. That's let's see. You asked about the rag joint, so let me see if I can show you that. So it all works. I just don't know if you're going to want to do anything with it or not. All right, let me uh, I'll start it up. I'll open the hood up, show you what you got until you swap your engine out. I'll do that in the next video.